Well, real quick, can we, can we get like a briefing? Can we like get in the clubhouse yeah. and? Yeah, yeah. I still don't know what the fuck's going on. Last I heard, we were still all square with Jack. What the fuck? Drop, drop. Rooftop, cross the way behind the box. Rooftop right in front of me. Yeah, car's down here. Don't go on that right. ladder. Be careful, they're trying to take pot shots to separate us. Don't be fucking dumb. Well, Paris. push the fucking pussy. There's one spot he can be. Cover me. Him up or let him. Still on the roof. He's got a shotgun. He's got a shotgun. Two of them. He just fell off the roof. Get his body. Bring him to the clubhouse. I'm still on the roof. I'm still on the roof. He's lit. Okay, want me to take this I got him down. I got him down. I got him down. 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 Go ahead. Go ahead. You feeling all right? Leave him in the garage there. Oh, I'm good. You got a lockpick? I don't. You got any lockpicks? No, I don't. don't. Fuck. Is everybody whole? Yeah, we're good. Alright, everybody get back in there before the cops show up. Where do you want me to put this fucking idiot? Put him in the garage with garage. the other one. I see a cop right on the street. We made him just. Wonder if we can make it. Well. I'll say maybe we can make it look like an accident, like a work related accident, but I don't think bullet holes happen here. Yeah, I have heard that counts have actually been carrying 9 millimeters lately. Like trailer made trailer. Oh, right here is fine. With all this blood right here, I mean, they'll probably have a hard time figuring out. I got this one. Do a whole process. Got him like a fucking pig. Gentlemen, what's uh, what's going on? What you guys doing? The so bird is going to pizza this to get some pizza, man. Yeah, <laughs> He's so full of shit. Get some uh, pizza with these bullets, maybe. Why are we uh, why are we making poor life choices today, gentlemen? Jack, we we've, we've been good up until today. What's what's the issue? What do you mean? You guys ran in the kid Bahama Mamas and pulled up on me for no reason. I don't even know what the hell I did that time. You robbed Bahama Mamas. Yeah, but you didn't yeah, even know that till afterwards. The prospect saw you go in there and with guns and then come out with guns. We were just yeah. having a nice little chat. Exactly. I was throwing my new airsoft gun. All the workers. <laughs> Your new airsoft gun? You mean the Tech 9 we took off? Well, I'm not talking I don't know about, about any Tech I talked about our nice little conversation earlier where we just wanted to go for a little road trip and have a simple conversation. Mr. Bowtie here made very poor life choices. What did I do? He tried to shoot me. When? Oh, I might not remember. It might be a little uh, foggy on it, but uh, earlier the the foundry area, we were just here trying to give Jack a nice little uh, little road trip. Huh? He came and he started shooting at me. When? Uh, a couple hours ago. Viper. That guy you was talking on front with with the cops for the white, I think that's the guy. I, I think the guy with the bow tie is completely different. Well, somebody did. Somebody in a bow tie, unless there's multiple dudes wearing bow ties. But either way, Jack.
Jack has been in, uh, involved in all of the events for the day. So my question is to Jack is, uh, what, you, what are you doing, man? What are you trying to accomplish? I didn't even do anything this time. You, I you told you I was just going to get You shot at no, us. What was, do you mean? <laughs> I was trying to hit the fuel tank and I missed. Yeah. Oh, so you're trying, so you're to, trying blow to blow up our building. Up. <laughs> <laughs> so where do we go from here, Jack? What is your choice going to look like in a couple hours? I think our beef here? is settled. I would well, say Is so. it? Like, we're good with that. But are we going to worry about you coming back? Because uh, I don't have to for... put on a kill on site order on you. That's yeah, true. listen, we, we settle our beef, and then it's over. If you keep yeah, coming done. back, well, we're going to keep going. We don't hold grudges. Yeah, we told you that, and hey, that's that's it. Just let me craft my weapons in peace, man. That's all I ask for. And all we're asking is that you buy from our distributor. Man, you guys charge like outrageous prices. Um, Not even close. Didn't charge shit. Wait, why are you so strict on guns? What you mean? Why can't you just let them craft? Because we run the guns. Are you positive? Why? Why do you guys run the guns? Because we said so. That's why. Okay, so what's stopping another orb from taking that from you? Nothing. Respect. Everybody understands. So, how is one guy making a gun oh, a crazy alert? Because if we let gun. one guy make a gun, then we gotta make Nobody the next has to know. guy make a gun. Then we gotta make the let the next guy make a gun. How? That's not how that works is, at this all. This is very simple. Gunman. If you guys, it if is. you guys run the guns, and you guys can choose who. Is allowed to craft them, right? Yeah, nope. we do choose, and it's us. Now, there's other places to get a hold of them. Why? It's not us. Man, I'm only in and out in like five minutes. So I just grab a room of scrap and just make myself a tech nine. I'll be on my way. That doesn't matter. If you want them, you're more than welcome to buy them from our distributor. Hey, Jack, we already explained that to you. What? You remember. Hello, Camp. Remember we cut a piece of your, your skin off? Well, you see, my I have short term memory loss. We can tell, Jack. Well, let me refresh your memory. Um, we cut your skin, a piece of your skin off because you were wearing a tattoo you weren't supposed to, and it's now a very important artwork piece in our uh, clubhouse. Uh, and we also told you you're done making guns. And you said, absolutely. I have. Those are the stock that I had left over from when I was still making them. See, but that's the other thing is you, you did promise that those the two guns we took off you then were the only ones. Well, they were on. that I had on me. Those are the only two guns I had we on me. Oh, see, but you know we're talking about more than just the ones in your pocket. That's Having a nice conversation with their friend were Jack. The last ones. Oh, you swear, still being the a ones fucking we idiot? just took off you, the last nah. ones you have in your possession, in any vehicle, oh, in any God. apartment stash, in any hid stashes, anywhere. Uh, yeah. No, Lewis, no, 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 Lewis. We, we know you guys have a deal. Alright, what's up? Let's make a up? deal. If we give you guys something that you want, I'd say every... Well, me and the prospect are gonna run up the bomb on Mama's. That we have to meet. We'll be back shortly. In order for us Hold on, to here we're gonna for a sec. Yeah, what if we pay you to be able to well, use it? Let me word it properly. What if we have dues every week that we have to pay in order for us to be allowed to craft whenever, you know, is necessary for us. Whether that's, you know... Like, well, this is, you, my, this is like, my metal, question metal on that. Scrap? This this is the only thing that makes me question it. If you're willing to pay us, why not just purchase the guns? No, no, no. How much, how much is a gun? Let's talk to them. We don't okay, sell. We just tell, sell yeah, we don't stuff. sell. I promise. Like, there's no yeah, see, that's so much work. Like, we gotta go find a wholesaler. We gotta do this. We gotta do that. Jack, we already you gave you the number. <laughs> dumbass. We, yeah, we gave <laughs> all you know have to call the number. Well, look, what if we give you, like, what if we give you 200 metal scrap a week? No, it's not about giving us a, a damn thing. You gotta understand. There's a guy out there that you can contact to get these fucking guns. Almost it's very simple. And we don't, and here's the thing, we don't control who he sells to. Are you talking about Hector? I'm talking about what? the number we gave you. 
the number you Man, I don't know what number I got. You gave me, I got like 20 numbers. Saved. Well, that's your own you fucking phone. It? I don't even remember getting the number. I could know I got Mikey's number, but I, I didn't, tell you didn't what, give me any of them. If we meet again in nicer terms, I'll make sure you get that number again. Or no I could maybe just, you know, get a pass on crafting. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Like yeah, that's not gonna happen. But see, here's Especially the thing: the way you've been, the way things have been going today, you don't have a whole lot of trust or faith in him. Yeah, I don't like I'm fucking getting shot at. Him. I mean, I do. I like the thrill of it. This is like you know, hunting my prey. In the but last 48 hours you've been well, well, the, the last few times where you, you guys pulled up on me, I didn't pull up on you. That's true. The last time we actually only just wanted to have a conversation with you, but you and your your buddy decided to escalate that. Well, all I saw was motorcycles and guns when I walked that pound. Um, I, I have a I question for you. Times. When's when's well, the last time you've time. attempted to craft? The uh, it's probably before there was a keypad put on there. Oh, exactly. Goodness. Look at that. So, I mean, you, there's no way to go around it. That's for sure, Spock, not giving you the key back to the warehouse. I mean, I can crack it, but it's just a lot of work. Exactly, <laughs> it is a lot of work. And it's a lot of, it's a lot of medical bills you're going to have to pay, too. Because we got two ways this can go, Jack, all right? Option number one, and this is the option I highly suggest you take. We part our ways here. You know, hell, we'll even drive you guys up to the hospital if you take option number one. Make sure you get the proper medical care. Option one is going to entail that you're done making the guns, as we have discussed previously. We'll give it a day or two, make sure everything, you know, gets nice and smoothed over. We'll get you in contact with the distributor. You can work directly with him. Maybe we even convince him to cut you a little bit of break on the price. Then you guys can go about your business and do whatever the fuck you want with those guns. But here's option also the two. thing. Oh, sorry. Go ahead, Mayor. Go ahead. Well, my thing is you're assuming that they're way overpriced I, I think you'd be surprised at how not they are I sell them to our distributor very very cheap so why can i just have like a vip membership that i pay you every week because you have like 15k it. weekly we're not a fucking casino jack or a fucking what charity see if if we had if i haven't had to shoot you twice in the last four hours hell you can you distribute yourself to, you, know? you know potentially do that but you, you kind of burnt that bridge, buddy. What about me? You haven't shot at me in the past four hours. You yeah, also wait, shot at us. Well, you're yeah, on the ground in front of me, so you tell me what that is. One Sorry. time. Wounded. Don't matter. One time. Yeah, Don't matter. You're picking, real, you're picking the wrong friends. Well, but hey, what do you mean? Uh, I mean, Jack, Jack's getting into hot water. It was like, like, you're lying in pig guts. I mean, I nasty. didn't even I didn't even know anyone in the city two days ago, and I've already gotten, like, six shootouts with Jack. It's, that should tell you all you need to know. I mean, Jack seems like a slow guy. He's just not making very good decisions right now. So, Jack, with that, I highly recommend you take option number one. It's going to result in a lot less medical bills, and it's going to result in us having a very healthy business relationship going forward from here. Um, option number two is you choose to ignore everything I've just said, attempt to craft the guns on your own, and every time we see you in the vicinity of Cypress Flats, we're going to shoot you. Shoot me? Absolutely. Well, why can't we just have a nice little chat like last time? Well, we can have all the chats you want if you take option number one. But option number two is going to result with you getting shot. Oh, we'll take option number one. We'll take option number one. Yeah, I think we'll take option number one. I think that's a fantastic idea. I agree. What we'll do is we'll go get the van. We'll get you boys loaded up, get you patched up at the hospital, all right? We'll even drive you down here to get you to my face again. What's up? Man, can I'm gonna get the guns that we had on us, so can you give us the guns back? Yeah, can we have those back? We don't have shit. Absolutely no. not. Are you Why? fucking crazy? You guys can buy them back. Yeah, you can buy them back if you want. We'll see. For how much? Can we, can we get, can we at least get our pistols back? You guys can't just I tell you what, I tell you what, we'll give you a nice little, he, here's the deal, right? We'll give you a little, uh, incentive, right? Just to give you an idea of how much these guns would cost you, right? So we'll give you a price on the guns that you just tried fucking killing my boys with. And that'll give you a, a, a little bit of an idea of uh, how much you're going to be buying these guns for. Okay? Because I'm damn sure not giving them back to you for fucking free. You got me completely fucked up. What about my pistol? Nothing. You, you ain't getting shit up. back. What kind of pistol was it? 
Well, we this thing got a wall there in a uh, combat. It it doesn't matter to me. You try shooting my boys, you ain't getting it back. I didn't shoot. I well, didn't to be fair, you're trying to shoot uh, the gas tank. Dude. Yeah, you're. <laughs> yeah, what about when I was climbing up the ladder? It's the same I really, shit. Really want to get that gas tank out of there. It's you know the thing. The weird thing is it's been empty for years. It sits up there in hog space. Honestly, you don't even use propane anymore. I'll tell you what. It would have been a clean shot too, bro. All of you guys would have been dead. Well, it's empty. So. Shut up! You're gonna ruin it. Tell you what, you said they had a, what a wall throwing a combat. Yeah. Those are bought from ammunition, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we don't care about those. Oh, is that what you do? I don't yeah. have any money. Yeah, the ammunition <laughs> charges an arm and a leg for those. I'll be honest with you. So, as a good faith gesture, if you guys choose the option number one, we'll take you to the hospital. We'll let you get patched up. We'll give you back the combat and the wall throw. So you guys at least have something to defend yourselves with, because I know you pissed off the triad too. Yeah, I think our beef is settled now. Now. Okay, that that I don't know, so I, we don't really have anything to do with that shit. You just happen to be really, really wrong place, wrong time, like multiple days in a row, buddy. It's you're having a rough time. Well, uh, they keep pulling up on me every single time I try to go there. You it's not my fault. Fucking, they have eyes and ears fucking everywhere. They, they pull up on us too. We have no idea where the fuck we're coming from. But it's a sign of good faith. We'll give you back the combat of the wall, so you at least have something to defend yourselves with in the event that something happens. But if you break that trust and you, you make me look dumb in front of my guys, well, that's just going to be real bad. So I just, I hope it doesn't come to that. No. Well, so can we buy back the shotguns or no? Nah, I think we keep those. Those will be well, the, uh, the tax for the day since you put a couple holes you in You already taxed me the other day and the day before that's that. because you keep making bad decisions. You keep doing it. Plus, we almost got busted by the cops. He lost his gun license. Yeah, thanks. What do you need a gun license for? So he can carry can't be carrying by the cops. He can't be carrying a bullpup pepper either way. Uh, I don't carry one. I'm going to get a sawed off. What do you mean? Just sticking in my pockets. So it's going to be one or two. I think they already chose option one, but we'll give them a second to consider. So option one. Option one, great idea. They pick All right. Fantastic so just, choice. Just to confirm, we're settled. There's no more. Beef done. Yeah, we won't be back. I swear. We're going to go do other things. All right. So we'll take it to the hospital. And then, yeah. in a, what would you say, Viper? Day or two, come down respectfully. You know, we'll get you in contact with our guy. And uh, we can start that beautiful relationship. Yeah, I'd say I'd say Tuesday. We'll, we'll give it through tomorrow because uh, tomorrow I'm probably won't, I won't be around too much at all. And uh, Tuesday, Tuesday night, come on down, give us a shout. We'll have a couple beers. We'll get you in contact with the distributor. You guys can go from there. All right, and you're not gonna send me away to the triad again, right? Nope. No, we're, we're gonna take you to the hospital. hospital. Hey, when we say something, we mean it. Yeah. We just expect others to uh, do the same as well, you know. And this place really does smell like fucking shit. So horrible. Oh, oh, well, yeah, just be thankful we didn't leave you down here. Yeah, if you left them in here, they would end up with tetanus. Yeah, no shit. <laughs>